What is up, YouTube family? Uh, welcome every single one of you individually, my brother or my sister, tuning into me, tuning into my video blog. In this video, we are going to catch a back and leg workout. I finally yesterday bought a 300 pound Olympic weight bar set the weight bar the olympic bar and 300 pounds to go with that bar so now the only next thing i need to get off of my list is a squat rack and then once i get that off my list within the next two months you guys will begin to see much more consistent videos of your boy putting in some great exercise onto youtube yeah if that made any fucking sense bear with me if i don't make any fucking sense i already am baked out of my fucking mind if you guys cannot tell of course i smoke all day every day and that is also what we are going to do together in this video before we catch this workout if you guys are not new to the channel then you know how i love to do things around this channel bring out your vape pens like your boy bring out your ganja bring out your pot bubbler straight shooter steamroller bong rig if you're gonna dab it your pre-roll your blunt joint what have you let me know down in the comments whatever it is you're smoking up on this beautiful wednesday afternoon it is currently 4 10 p.m the time frame and day i am recording this video blog on and like i said before i do anything and everything anything and everything all day every day i love to get fucking baked out of my mind i love to smoke that herb and if you guys do too bring out your ganja like i said and let me know in the comments what type of strain you're smoking up indica sativa hybrid and the name of your strain throw it down below because you know i want to know what is your boy smoking up i am smoking up an indica strain this is a live resin cartridge the the name of this brand that i am smoking out of is friendly farms like I said, it is a live resin, it is an OG, it is an indica, and the name of this strain is Pink Panties OG. Yes, it's a weird kind of name. I don't know who named it, but it tastes fucking bomb. I don't know what Pink Panties tastes like, but it definitely does taste fucking fire. So let me know in the comments if you guys have picked up some Friendly Farms in the past. And if not, if you guys love to smoke some live resin what type of brand personally i love to go for buddies but the shop that i hit up they are out of buddies so my second go-to is friendly farms and my third go-to is raw garden reason being is because of their lawsuit they have had multiple lawsuits in the past claiming because they are claiming that they that they are live resin 100 percent yet they are not so be careful do your homework out there know what you're smoking up and yeah, I'm ready to take some dabs. Hopefully you guys are too. Let's get baked before we put in that fucking work. Get after our health, strength, vitality, longevity, and great quality of fucking life. Exercise benefits us in all of those concepts. It benefits us all around the spectrum. It benefits our health, our cognition, our ability to retain memory, our ability to obtain and sustain physical beauty physical strength looking good is a byproduct of setting health as a goal you feel me we should all be striving for health just because no matter what we are going to age you feel me and as we age we are subjected to becoming frail weak and or dependent on dependent on nurses and or medication as we age as we become older you feel me we want to manage these things we want to keep things such as illnesses diseases cancers at bay we want to keep them from ever fucking manifesting in our life from ever even showing up you feel me exercise benefits us in so many ways that it is uh crazy not to indulge into it every single day it's not crazy but it's kind of stupid not to indulge in it because it's a free source of medicine that's the way i see it it's a preventative source of medicine and all you have to do is indulge in it 30 minutes of your day five days of your fucking week not even seven days of the week not even six but five fucking days 30 minutes of those days 30 minutes within each of one of those each and every one of those days 
push yourself get some high intensity going get the blood circulating and flowing through all of your organ cells tissues and glands get the blood get the body to sweat you feel me get the heart rate elevated and get your heart muscle to work get your get your just get everything to flow you feel me that's the intention the intention is to put st physical stress on our body this is a form of healthy physical stress only to grow more resilient more integral internal more internal integral health and vitality feel me especially in our modern day and age where we are full of fear lingering in our psyche and our subconscious mind and just in the world in general people fearing the stupid virus and whatever the people in power and our leaders are telling us to get vaccines and this and that and they're not even really educating us on real health and wellness on getting proper exercise proper diet proper rest and proper nutrition in general overall that all conquers and trumps fucking any vaccine that any man can ever make you feel me that's a whole nother video in and of itself but yeah Long story short, there you go. Let's get after our health and not be stupid fucking human beings. You feel me? Let's let's be fucking smart, be wise, and get after our own self-discipline and indulge in those healthy habits that sustain good health, vitality, and longevity. You feel me? So that's enough of me fucking ranting. With that being said, let's take a couple fucking dabs. And yeah, cheers, fam. That was a really long fucking dab. I picked up this battery two days ago at a smoke shop. It's a battery that doesn't belong to any cannabis brand. However, it is a battery that does connect to cannabis cartridges. Like I said, I bought it at a smoke shop. The name of this brand is called Ooze. The brand is irrelevant. This battery is the shit. As you guys saw, the blinker takes probably what, 20 fucking seconds to fucking blink fattest dab i've ever took out of a cartridge that's for sure but thanks to the pen and on top of that it has a temperature controlling mechanism so i have it on the highest temp right now i'm burning through it like crazy literally if you guys want to see how it works check out this cartridge it was a full gram yesterday it's only midday today and i'm already more than halfway through it not only is it because your boy is a stoner but it's because this pen this battery comes through. Woo! <coughs> <coughs> that one dab was at least like, felt like three dabs in one. <coughs> Fuck. I just feel the head switch kicking in. But as it kicks in, we are not gonna sit on our ass. We're not gonna be lazy and not fucking do anything we're not gonna sit there and just fucking scroll through social feeds and just read shit, watch it on YouTube, watch videos, this and that, fucking jack off and watch porn, no. We're gonna be productive and <coughs> get after that fucking self-discipline, like I said, and work the fuck out. If you guys don't have what I am gonna use and present in this video, it doesn't fucking matter. Still get after it. You feel me? You don't need weights. Use your own physical body. Do some jump squats. Do some jumping jacks. Do some push-ups. Do some clapping push-ups if you have more strength and conditioning than the average Joe. Push yourself. Get creative. You feel me? Don't just procrastinate and do nothing is my point. So let's take another dab <coughs> and then get after that work. Cheers, man. all right that's enough of me smoking i'm pretty fucking baked hopefully you guys are baked too if you're not baked yet get baked and let's get after that work all right you guys so we're gonna start with legs we are gonna do some lunge walking back and forth this distance that you guys see right here 
it is about 30 yards for those of you guys that are curious with what type of length i am working with and for the weight i am doing 30 pounds nothing too crazy i am going to do 30 no not 30 sorry what the fuck i am big five sets again like i said back and forth that going there and back is one we are gonna do five sets 30 pounds let's get it That's one set, like I said, five, so four more. Let's get it. second set three more all right you guys second exercise we are still working on our legs we are gonna hit the barbell with 25 pounds on each side and the reason we are going to keep it at 25 pounds and or go go lower than that is because i do not own a squat rack yet so i cannot put heavy weight and have something to catch the weight you feel me so with that being said, like I said, five sets of each and every exercise that we get after together today. Almost forgot, try to hit 10 to 15 reps as much as you can if you're hitting a light weight like me. High reps, 15 to 20 reps. Alright you guys, second set, let's go. Alright you guys, that is going to conclude our leg workouts. Now we are jumping onto our back. We are going to start with barbell rows. Again, 25 pounds on the barbell. I have 10 pounds on the floor, so when we add that to the barbell, it will accumulate to 35 pounds. The barbell itself is 45 pounds, if you guys, already, if you guys don't know that already. There you go. So you do the math, that is how much that is how much weight we are pulling. So, like I said, five sets of each exercise. This exercise we are going to aim for 10 to 15 reps. Let's get it.
Nice, we ended up getting in 20 reps. So if you feel you could do more than I said, push yourself. We're gonna add 10 pounds and get in that second set. All right, you guys, so I just added the 10 pounds to the 25, making it 35 pounds. And while I was doing that, I decided mentally that I am going to superset this exercise with some pull-ups to get in two exercises. Rest for about a minute, bang out four more sets. Let's get it. getting those pull-ups again like I said I got that power tower Whew. let's get it All right, you guys, so with the pull-ups, you don't have to do a specific amount of reps, just as many as you can. It is a superset. Get in those reps, push yourself, and I'll catch you guys in the next Let's go, third set. <clears throat> Let's get it. Low key can't wait to get in some nutritious fucking liver and bone marrow after this exercise. Some very nutrient dense food. Let's get it. Shit. Is that even high enough? Let's get it. All right, you guys, so to conclude our leg and back workout, we are going to finish off with some barbell lawn mowers. We have about 110 pounds on the barbell right now, 235s of 25, and the barbell itself is 45 pounds. And we are gonna add some weight or take off some weight depending, depending on how we feel as we increase the sets. So again, five sets. 10 to 15 reps let's get it Right, you guys let's get a second set we are gonna add a 10 pound weight increasing the intensity but that is how we gain strength and health resiliency by putting healthy stress on the body let's get it
Getting that third set, push fucking through it. Again, like I said, five sets each and every exercise. You guys don't slip up, don't slack off. Don't cheat yourself. Let's get it. Alright family, that is going to conclude today's workout. Short, good intensity, medium intensity, medium to, to high intensity. Not a long workout, but not a super small workout. It is a good, short, medium sized workout. I hope you guys get after it. I hope you guys put in that work. Don't just smoke and sit on your ass and be entertained and tell yourself you're gonna get after it no fuck that actually fucking get up and get after it you feel me it's only gonna benefit you all around the spectrum like we spoke about in the beginning of this video only gonna enhance your vitality your longevity your great quality of life as you age in this ex in this existence and so yeah with that being said Let's close out this video with a couple of dabs. I am winded because, man, I was pulling some heavy weight. It didn't look like it. Again, like I said, I barely bought this 300 pound Olympic bar weight set yesterday. So it is heavy to me. I haven't been hitting the fucking gym or hitting some heavy fucking weights in a long fucking time. I've only been exercising with my kettlebells. If you guys are interested, as to what I eat on the daily and just in general exercise posts that I don't put up on YouTube. On the daily, check out my Instagram. I will leave the information to my Instagram in the description of this video if you guys are interested. <sighs> For example, today's post-workout meal, I'm going to have some raw liver, raw egg yolks, um, some raw bone marrow, a protein shake with some raw milk some mineral rich salt to follow all of that and yeah if you guys are interested and want to see all of that i post that on my instagram follow my instagram so with that being said get after it back and leg workout today completed let's take some dabs close out this video cheers fam I'm definitely going to be more consistent with my exercise posting just to motivate every single one of us to get up and get after it. This is only going to make our species more independ independent and not dependent on the medical system because the medical system has been failing us for a long time. It is time for us to take ownership and responsibility, responsibility for our own selves and our own health. You feel me? So... Exercise plays a major factor and role in that. So let's motivate each other. Let's get after it. That is my intention behind these videos. Not for any egotistical reasons, but for the reasons and purposes and intentions of motivating one another to vitalize our own health. You feel me? It's a good habit. Let's get after it and let's make it a good habit. Woo! Cheers, fam. I am fucking baked. Hopefully you guys are too. And hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure to leave the thumbs up. Leave a love comment. It supports your boy. It supports the channel. Helps the channel grow. And fuck. I am going to go inside. Get in some nutrition. Enjoy the rest of my night. Go to class. I have 
online classes zoom class right now at 5 15 so get in some quick nutrition log in take my biology fucking lecture all the way up until 8 p.m then have my dinner knock the fuck out and call it a fucking day like i said if you guys enjoyed it leave the thumbs up helps your boy out as always make sure you guys are living your fucking truth because living your truth is being of service to someone somewhere out there and I truthfully believe we all came to live a purposeful, meaningful, serviceful fucking life. You feel me? If that's even a word. If it's not, just made it up. Fuck it. And yeah, have a good rest of your fucking night. Have a good rest of your fucking day. Whatever time frame you're watching and tuning into this video at. And I'll catch you guys in tomorrow's exercise. Later.